So this one's the 14th year. Mm -hmm. So we're prepping big time for next year. That'll be our 15th year. We're really excited that we're able to actually run this year because, you know, after the lockdowns with COVID and all of the issues that the, the live music industry has faced, this is like a huge celebration for us to be able to actually up and running and get going again. Really excited. Okay, so tomorrow, for the first time ever, we're actually partnering with the Australian High Commission, Westpac, the Fiji Times, um, and bringing out the Domo Votali mm -hmm. competition. So the finalists are actually on stage live tomorrow. This is a really exciting um, opportunity for Knox Entertainment as well, um, because these guys are the future of the Fiji music industry. So to have them straight up on the uprising stage is amazing. They're really excited. We're excited to work with them. And the thing that Knox and I love the most is these guys are bringing original music to the table. And that's something that we've really, you know, been pushing along original, original, original because there's so many talented people. So we're super excited about that. That's at the two, two o'clock time slot tomorrow, uh, sorry, Saturday. So encouraging everybody to get down at two o'clock because you're about to see the future generation of the Fiji music industry. Okay, so on Saturday we've got Sam Stevens, he's a veteran of the Uprising, um, amazing solo artist, he's, he's starting off for us. We've got Natalie, of course, uh, we've got the Marta Dance Group. Now these guys have done some amazing videos recently and they're really, really a great dance company, so we're really looking forward to working with them. It's their first time at the uprising, up on the Uprising stage. We've got Nikki Be Beddoes from Nandy and her band Overcast. Um, Nikki's been really lovely to work with and uh, she's a great performer and has an amazing voice like her mum so mm. we're excited to have her. We've also got Mike Raymond, so Mike Raymond and Blue Vein. Mike's one of the oldest musicians on the day and he's told us this will be his last live performance at Uprising so we're a bit sad about that because he's a great old rocker and uh, we, yeah, we love working with Blue Vein. We've also got Aggie. Aggie's wonderful and you know she always puts on an amazing sh um, stage show. Um, she's also got something special lined up we hear so we can't wait to see her. Um, we've got Albie and a bit of a mash-up band here so it's Albie and a few of the boys from Four, Qu Four Quarters so you know they're going to be great. One we're really excited about is The Relative. The Relative have got back together and they're a great band. We absolutely can't wait to see them on stage again. Um, we've got the gang and we've got the boys from RBG and then we've got DJ Kristenite as well. So we've got a great lineup. It's a, a really talented lineup and you know, great guys, great women. It's going to be fantastic. Of course there'll be food. Yeah, so food will be um, a big part of the festival. So, you know, we've got I'm going to sort of save that as a surprise, but there's a few, um, we've got new grills, of course, they're always supportive of our events. Um, we have a Filipino ladies coming down, there's um, Leilani and her team from um, the barbecues, so yeah, there's a lot of nice food. Um, we've also got, for the first time ever, we've got a girl coming in who's doing makeup and body art, so that's really excited, so we can really get into that festival vibe and that spirit with body art and makeup. That's exciting. A lot of giveaways for the families, for the kids during the day. So um, of course from 6pm we become an adults only venue because uh, everyone likes to party after 6 and we are alcohol sponsored event. FM 96 love to have fun on stage after 6 so yeah the little ones have to go home by 6. Absolutely, there's always lessons. I think, I was just explaining to Charles, I think for us Knox Entertainment we're actually really calm going into this event. We have great relationships with our sponsors and our supporters. We're a very well-oiled machine. It's the longest running event in Fiji, music-wise. It's professional. We've got um, systems and processes in place that, that are, there's expectations from performers, suppliers. Everybody knows what they have to do and we all just do it and get on and, and you know, we all do a great job. So um, we're super grateful to all of our partners. Um, Woodstock, CFL, Modern Electric, Stage Tech, everybody that's helped bring this event together again at a little bit short notice because of everything with COVID. So yeah, we're nice and calm, hitting the ground running and ready to rock. Be fast because this morning there was only 102 left. So if you miss out, please don't call us and tell us, yes, I missed my ticket, you've had plenty of time and we are going to sell out. Thank you.